It's Tuesday, April 23rd here in Seoul, and this is Korea's Daily News for Korea Now. I'm Jamie Chung. Samsung Electronics Company said Tuesday will postpone the release of its Galaxy Fold smartphone in the United States, primarily due to the problems found in the handset's folding screen. The South Korean tech giant had originally planned to start selling the world's first foldable smartphone on Friday. The Galaxy Fold was first unveiled in February with positive initial market responses. Samsung decided to postpone the product's U.S. market launch after some users from its test reviewer group reported malfunctions in the affordable Infinity Flex display earlier this month. The company said because of the smart tablet hybrid's folding nature, there are minute gaps in the device and the screen that are vulnerable to shock and debris. The company said it will look into ways to enhance the screen protection of its new model. Moving on to K-pop, BTS' new song, Boy With Love, snagged the 8th spot on Billboard's main singles chart, The Hot 100, US Billboard magazine said on Tuesday. Boy With Love is the lead track of BTS' new 7-track album, Myth of the Soul, Persona. Boy With Love has flown high ever since its release on April 12, marking the Septet's second top 10 of the Billboard's Hot 100. BTS first reached the top 10 of the Hot 100 in November 2018 with Fake Love. Before BTS, K-pop solo artist Psy was the only Korean musician to win two songs on the Billboard's Hot 100 chart with his super hits Gangnam Style and Gentleman. BTS' new album, Map of the Soul Persona, debuted atop the Billboard 200 for this week, becoming the first band since Beatles to score three Billboard No. 1 albums in less than a year. The latest chart result will be officially released Tuesday in U.S. time. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un will soon visit Russia for his first summit with President Vladimir Putin, North Korean state media, the Korean Central News Agency, reported Tuesday. The KCNA, however, did not mention the exact date or location of the summit. The upcoming summit will be first meeting between North Korea and Russia in eight years. Kim's late father, former leader Kim Jong-il, met then-Russian President Dmitry Medvedev in 2011. The Kremlin earlier announced Kim and Putin will meet later this month but did not provide details. Citing multiple sources, the Russian newspaper Commerçant has reported that Kim will arrive in Vladivostok on Wednesday and hold a summit with Putin at a Far Eastern Federal University of the following day. The North Korea-Russia summit will be Kim's first overseas visit after his February summit with U.S. President Donald Trump has ended without a deal on denuclearization. And those are your top news for today. For full-length articles of today's stories, please head over to english.yonamnews.co.kr and please don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for more updates on Korea Now.